This is our driver, Daniel. Hello. Daniel, where do you live? In Copan. Copan, Honduras. Honduras. Okay. Yeah. And where are you taking us today? To Kiriguá. Kiriguá. Mayan ruins of Guatemala. Okay. So you've been, you've done this before? Yeah. Okay. All right. Perfect. <laughs> All right, man. Hello, everybody. <laughs> well, here we are. Guatemala, Kiriguá. Got a light rain falling. And we're going to explore the Mayan ruins here. Here we are in Carigua. They're supposed to have the largest stelas anywhere in the Mayan world. Tallest. This looks like a big rock that somebody just decided to decorate. This one is absolutely fantastic. Great condition. And from what I'm told by an expert, this is the only place in the Mayan world where you see these type of large roundish things being all carved up on all sides. Now this guy here looks like at one point in his life he did a face plant. I mean, there's not much there. We're looking at a couple of incredibly tall stelas here. These guys are monstrous. And looking down the plaza to the temple at the end there, we'll be there in a little bit. We are here in Caregua looking at some of these uh, stelas. What do you think about all this? I mean, I compare this to Copan. Be, I don't know. What do you think? I think, well, one, the stelas are taller and the That's artwork true. seems different. Yeah. And we're going to look at one over there where it looks like they just take the artwork on the front and wrap it around to the sides. But it, it's different and it's very quiet here. Yeah, it's very nice. Very nice and so quiet. We're enjoying it. Wish you were here. Hi, Mom. Now this bad boy has had some damage. You see they've stuck some rebar in here trying to hold him together. But this one is unique. I mean the artwork on the front wraps around to the side here. Well here is the temple area, I'm presuming. And somewhere around here there's a ball court. We've been looking all over this site for the ball court, and uh, we finally found it. It's right here. You can kind of see a ridge. That's one side of it. Another ridge, that's the other side of it. It's about a meter underground, so we're told. This is what that whole plaza area would look like if it was excavated with a temple here, ball court here, and then these would be the stands for watching the game. But they still have more work to do on this site. Here is a find. This ancient artifact was probably used for people to do just this. To sit and enjoy the day looking at the stela. Probably what uh, this was all about. Buenos dias, Pedro. Hitting up with Daniel. Hey. hey! Good morning, sir. How are good you? Good morning. Fine. How are you this morning? Very good. Now, Daniel, okay. yes, just sir. a quick question. If somebody was coming to Copan and they wanted to take a tour, uh -huh. they could contact you? Yes. So from we're, here in Copan, what yeah. could they do? In Copan, we have a, a, the tours. And we have a horseback riding, horses, uh, tours for the hot springs, okay. and waterfalls, and like coffee plantation tours okay. in, the, in the mountains. Yeah, and we have a, we take a, another and then other places in the mountains, nice okay. trails in the forest, hiking a little bit. We have a zip line tour. Okay. Yeah, right. we have a nice tours. And we can show you like a bird, nice, uh, ni nice places, nice beautiful okay. places. Mayan village in the mountains. Okay. And, and you can see that people work in ceramic, uh, typical jobs. And okay. we take the tourists, and the tourists try it to make it too. Okay. Yes, sir. All right. Daniel was our driver over to Guatemala. And I will tell you this, he is a safe driver, he is a good driver, and we had a great time. So, call this number if you want to contact Daniel when you are here in Copan.